vlog camera and we're gonna go through my favorite top tier lotions body butters all that actually let me move them to the side because i don't want y'all to see them before i announce them hold up wow my table's dirty hold on one second we about to be doing the ultimate lotion body butter oil review and this isn't really so much a review because I f with all of this stuff. Um, I am going to tell you about each product, why you need it, what you need it for, what's great about it, what's not, and then I'll like rate them. I did include some drugstore, but I'm gonna keep it real with y'all. I am only showing y'all the ones that I use religiously. Like I get it, if you're on a budget, I totally understand. Um, save your coins for one out of all of them that you like. If you like what you hear about what I say, that's the one for you. Like that is the one for you, sis. So yeah, um, let's just hang out, let's vibe. I was gonna get wine, but honestly, I think I've maxed out my calories for the day. I kind of went crazy today. So we're just gonna have our Panera Bread green tea. And we're gonna talk about lotions and body butters. I just wanna let you guys know this was requested. I had somebody write this in one of my videos and I thought it was a really good idea because I've never done this where I went through all my favorite lotions and body butters only. Let's go through it. I'm just gonna grab the first one that I see and start with that. Oh, do not forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And if you guys like these chill, sit down vibes, we're not like too studio-like, we're not too vibey vibe, we're just kind of chilling with the vlog camera, hanging out, wearing cute clothes, listening to music, getting our snacks and our drinks, and chilling, then y'all already know the vibes. Okay, let's just get into the video. Okay, first one we have is a Summer Fridays Summer Skin Nourishing Body Lotion. Okay, so this one right here is ultimate summer vibes. Now I will say, I do wear this in the fall because I like the way it smells. It's very neutral smelling. It's giving a light, fragrant coconut, but not too coconutty. Hold on. Yeah, it's giving like light coconut almond. Does it say what the scent is? Okay, it says coconut, vanilla blossom, and warm almond. Wow, I am on it. This is so good straight out of the shower. It's very white, so you really have to blend it in. So if you don't got time, you're not gonna want this lotion because you need time to rub this in. It's moisturizing. This right here will have your skin looking so healthy. Like it's not gonna give an oil sheen, but it's gonna give a healthy sheen. So if you suffer from ashiness, you know what I'm saying? Like if you suffer from the cracked ankles, if you suffer from like the cracked kneecaps, if you're suffering from just like an ashy overall vibe, or you just want something super hydrated out of the shower, this is my out of shower one. I'm gonna rate this a nine out of 10 because it smells good, it feels good. The only reason why it's not a 10 out of 10 is because it takes mad long to rub in. That's all, but Summer Fridays, thank you so much. This is honestly like a great lotion. Okay, next up is my new favorite lotion of all time. The Laura Mercier Cream Brulee. This is, I'm about to get this cookie. You already know. I'm not gonna say it because I will get demonetized. This smells so good. Okay, so first things first, what I do not like about it, I'm just gonna say that, is I hate anything where I gotta dip my fingers in because I have claws. Claws, claws, claws. I have claws, I have claws. And dipping my hand in things like this is kind of annoying. I gotta get crafty. I have to do like my knuckle and then put it on my body that way. But other than that, this is honestly so good. It smells like a cookie. It smells exactly what it is. It's cream brulee. It's so good. You are gonna be walking around smelling like an edible dessert cause you are. And it's very moisturizing. I have a hair on my face. It's giving moisture, it's giving creamy, it's giving luxurious. I'm gonna rate this a 10 out of 10 because it smells good, it feels good, it's moisturizing, and it's just honestly like all around the best lotion for my skin, especially during the fall. I would suggest this is actually, okay, let me take back my rating. I'm gonna rate it a 9.5 because you can't wear it all year round. I would not suggest to wear this in summer. It doesn't really vibe, like the smell doesn't vibe with summer scents, but this right here is fall and winter on deck. This is giving Netflix and chill. This is giving D appointment. This is giving, I'm trying to be his wife. Yeah. Now this right here, I love it so much that it's damn near empty. Like it literally doesn't even work. I have to like open up the cap just to get it out. This is the Osea Anti-Aging Body Balm. This is not cheap, y'all. It's not cheap. It's kind of expensive, but it's worth every penny. This right here will save lives. It will cure world hunger. Okay, that's going way too far, enough. Um, this right here is honestly the truth. I'm obsessed with this. Like this is so sexy. Like. This is the type of stuff that you put on your skin if you want to look like a disco ball, but not in a sparkly way, but in like a shiny way when you go out. So I like this on my legs, my chest, my arms. It is so freaking shiny and it's not greasy. Like it feels very nice on the skin. If somebody were to like touch your chest, they wouldn't go, ooh, what the frig is that? Like it's more moisturizing than it is greasy and it's not sticky. This is giving 10 out of 10 
overall the packaging is amazing the smell is lemony it's very twangy citrus 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 it's creamy but it rubs in easily it's oily but not too oily it's not greasy and it feels just right this is gonna have you moisturized looking good smelling good feeling good you're not even gonna need perfume when you wear this that's how good it is i'm just letting y'all know so we have the nivea soft refreshingly soft moisturizing cream for face body and hands okay this right here is so moisturizing and i like that it can also be put on the face so for all of my gals who need like face body hands feet everything you're gonna have it all in this it's moisturizing it's great one thing i will say is it smells like nivea like you're not gonna get like a perfume vibe from it but that's okay like nivea smells good to me like i don't feel like it smells bad there are some lotions that i feel like stink this does not stink it smells neutral which i like so i'm gonna rate this an 8 out of 10 it's moisturizing it feels nice it's universal so you can use it wherever and it's affordable and it's at the drugstore <sighs> okay next up we have the Fenty Skin Body Butter Drop Whipped Oil Body Cream. Okay, I feel like there's mixed reviews on this and I'm about to just give y'all the tea, okay? First of all, it smells amazing. It's, it's, it's giving. I don't know what it's giving. I couldn't really put my, like, my scent, but it's giving floral, floral, floral clean. I'm gonna give it floral clean. This is very moisturizing, very hydrating. Um, I love it. It smells so good. This is honestly giving very youthful. Why is it not going on? It's very youthful. It's very, very, very young and cute and just everything that anybody would ever want. It's moisturizing. It feels good. Um, only reason why I would say it's not a 10 out of 10 is because I don't want to dip my like, you know what I mean? I don't want like my claws. Like I like a pump, like, and most of these are actually not pumps. So Let's get with the pumps, guys. Like, I like a pump. Or if it can't be a pump, can it be, like, just, like, a regular, like, squirt? Because I can't stand this. Like, this, I don't like using these. But, I mean, I get it. It's a body butter. It's thicker than the average. You're going to have to figure something out. But it smells so good. It's, it, I could see Rihanna wearing this. Like, she definitely wears this. And I, I could see her smelling like this. It smells that good. Um, it's long-lasting, too, which I like. And um, it's just really nice. And there's actually a lot in here. 300 milliliters. Okay, so this is significantly more. Um, and then what are you? Because you ran out of me pretty fast. This is 150 milliliters, five fluid ounces. Clown, no one. All right, this is new in my collection, but I'm already obsessed with it. It's the Loctane Milk Concentrate Almond Body Lotion. I think it's a lotion. Um, smells really good. It kind of gives me like grown woman baby powder vibes. So if you like, it's not really almondy. Like I really wouldn't say this is almondy. The shower oil is, but this is not. This is more baby powder. And I do like the way this feels. Um, it's pretty moisturizing. I'll rate like the moisture, like a five out of 10 because I've had way more moisture than this. But I like this for out of the shower because sometimes I just don't want to feel too like, uh, like I don't want to feel too, too, too saturated out of the shower. So I'll do this followed after as a follow-up after the almond shower oil and this is just really nice like i don't know guys i really like this a lot um i'm gonna rate this like an eight out of ten i would suggest that if you can pick this up before the sale ends which is in like literally let me see what's today the 14th tomorrow so tomorrow if this you know for the sale they have a holiday set i would pick this up just so you guys can try the the shower oil um this and then it also comes with the hand cream i don't know the holiday set's worth it to me Okay, let's do a tried and true, baby. Um, bum bum cream. Excuse me, I should know the pronunciation at this point. It's boom boom cream. Sol de Janeiro. Okay, this is kind of what got me on the map, right? I was like, I feel like the first person to talk about this on the internet. Um, don't at me. I love this so much. I will always love it. It's kind of a hit or miss for some people. I think that some people actually really despise the scent and some people love it. Um, for me, it's orgasmic. Like smelling this smells like sex to me. It's so good. Like, I feel like this is very summery, um, but you can also wear it in the fall and winter. Like, I don't feel like it has, like, a specific season. But if I were to say where it would fall the best, definitely in the summertime. It is so moisturizing. Like, this will have your skin looking so good. I, I rate the moisture, like, a 9.5 out of 10. It smells good. It smells like perfume. You wear this on your body when you go out, people are going to think you're wearing perfume. And you're not. You're wearing freaking lotion. So, to me, it's a two-for-one. If you don't feel like going out and buying a new perfume, you can just buy a lotion, and there you go. We have the Bomb Dia Bright Cream. This one right here, like, it's almost gone. When I tell you this right here is, like, my actual obsession i'm dead serious um this is even better than the bum bum boom boom brazilian cream to me um this right here smells insane like insanely good the way it smells on the skin i i honestly put this on 
if there was seven days in the week, I'm putting this on at least five days of the week out of the shower. I'm obsessed. Like I have so much stuff. Like even the stuff that I'm showing you guys today, this isn't all the stuff I have. This is just my top ones that I use religiously. This one right here, I probably use the most out of everyone. The Bum Dia from Sol de Janeiro. This smells so good to me. The only thing, the only negative thing that I can say about this lotion is it doesn't pair well with every single perfume you own. You gotta do something floral or sweet with this or maybe vanilla-y, but you can't do like musky or anything like that because it just doesn't go. This is very like, I can't even explain the scent. Let me see what it says. It says it has fruit AHAs and vitamin C in it. Let me see. Does it have a scent? Charosa, Charosa 40. It, 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 I would say it's fruity floral, fr fr fruity floral and like maybe a little like vanilla or something. I don't know. I will let you guys know if I find anything, but overall just go into your local Sephora and just give it a sniff. I'm telling you, you're going to obsess over this. And the way it smells on at least my body chemistry is insane. Like I put this on my skin. I drench myself from my neck all the way down to my feet and I will walk out of my apartment and go get a package and people will go, Oh my God, you smell so good. You're welcome. Just saying. Okay. Moving on to oil. So I don't know what is wrong with me, but I forgot to mention this in my Durham store video. This is the Eminence, Eminence, Eminence Stone Crop Body Oil. I've been using this like probably every time I go out, drench my body fresh out of the shower after like a body butter situation. I'll put this on right after and I'm glistening neck all the way down to my toes. This is probably one of the best body oils I've ever owned. Um, I did drop it the other day and break the top. So it's permanently stuck open, which is fine because I use it every day. So it doesn't matter. This is a great body oil. If you like to look oily, then you're going to like this. I like looking oily. I think it looks hot. Like when you wear like a nice oil. And also I do find what's great about this oil is it doesn't transfer too much onto the clothes. Like I feel like it's not going to like make your clothes look oily. Like sometimes you have an oil on and it like gets all over your clothes. That's not this one. This one's really great and it blends in nice with the skin. I love it. Um, I do find it's very difficult to find body oils that I like and I love this one. And what I also can say about this is it smells very unique. So nobody's gonna have this scent on their body, which I like, like I like smelling different than other people. I don't know, I just do. Okay, next up is one of my absolute favorite products of all time. I'm actually wearing it tonight. I don't know if you guys can really tell, which by the way, like my boobs, like, like if they could just sit up a little bit higher, we would be like good in the hood, but we're not. Is Clinical Youth Body Serum. This right here, I'm obsessed with. Like, like it's a spray, first of all, which is insane. It's, it's giving the perfect amount of um, like a refreshing like serum vibe, but it's 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 kind of like water based, so it's not going to leave you oily or greasy or sticky or anything. This is like the perfect water based serum body spray oil, and it's very easy. If you're lazy like me, sometimes you want to put on the lotion, you want to put on the oil, but you just don't got time. This is perfect. You literally just spray it all over the body, rub it in really quick. You barely have to rub it in, and you're out the door. It's that good, and I'm just obsessed. The smell is really nice. It's it's refreshing. It's clean, and I just think that it's really sexy. And like if you want to pretend like you're sweating at the gym you could just spray this on before you go to the gym and then everyone's gonna think that you really worked hard just saying i'm not saying i've ever done it but just saying it's really that good this right here probably use it almost every single day for at least one part of my day because i do change my outfit probably like 17 times a day that's why i'm always doing laundry but i um, obsessed with this it's so good and it's it's definitely a 10 out of 10. Okay, we have my next go-to, which is my Nivea Shea Daily Moisture 48 Hour Deep Nourishing Serum for dry skin. This is perfect for the fall and winter. This is at Target. It's amazing. It's the perfect lotion to just have like in your bedroom. I love how moisturizing it is. The moisturizing level of this is insane. Like I feel so like if I was chapped dry and, and in an avalanche storm and I came home and I put this on my body you wouldn't even think that I was ever chopped and dry in an avalanche storm it's that good like this will have you nursed back to freaking health this is honestly something that everybody should have in their collection of lotions and use this religiously especially on your drier parts of your skin I know for me in the winter time like weird parts of my body get dry like the back of my legs and like my butt and and my back and my shoulders and like my feet like so I'll just put this all over those spots because it's cheap it's easy and I can just lather it all over the place and it's really easy to rub in unlike other lotions from 
in the drugstore, which sometimes just take so long to rub in. This doesn't. This is a 10 out of 10. Get your Nivea. What's going on? I'm sure you guys all have something from Nivea, but if you don't have this one, then you don't have any of them. Bye. Okay, another favorite lotion of mine is the Way Body Cream. This is a summer. This is a summer lotion, but when I tell you this is orgasmic, I'm obsessed. So the moisturizing level to this, I'll rate it like a, a seven out of 10. I'm not gonna say that I feel like so freaking like buttery afterwards, but I'm gonna say this. It does give you the perfect summer moisturizing vibe. So I like to put this on like before I'm about to hit the pool and I wanna like, you know, put a little lotion on my skin really quick and just make myself look a little bit more presentable because I'm still dry and chapped in the summertime sometimes. Um, this is great for that. And the smell is just insane. Like, I've never smelled anything like this. It's giving grown woman baby powder mixed with like an ocean spray, mixed with like, just like a gorgeous like beach sand. Like, this is so, whoever made this scent, thank you, thank you, thank you. Like, it is so good. And this again, perfume vibes. Like, I love that. And it's not irritating. It feels good on the skin. It's lightweight. I'm gonna rate this an 8.5 out of 10. It's that good. Okay, on those days when I'm feeling very like eczema-y, eczema e. Um, First Aid Beauty has great ultra repair cream. This obviously is multi-use. You can use it on your face, your hands, your feet, wherever. Um, I love this. It's so freaking thick. Like, it's just, it's insanely thick. And it's good for whenever I, you know, have a little bit of like a dry chap situation going on. I'm going to rate this a 10 out of 10 because to me it's medical. It, it's, it's very medically made to where it will actually fix whatever is hurting or broken or whatever on your skin. Like, if something is actually dry and chapped and, it's, and it's, it honestly might need something a little bit heavier than like a regular lotion, this is going to be your, your guy. Like this to me is like my saving grace. It's my doctor in a bottle. Okay, on those lighter days when we just want to quickly put a little something on the skin, we're already feeling a little moisturized, but we just want something on the skin. We have the Necessaire Body Serum, fragrance-free. I wanted to include this in today's video because it's fragrance-free. If you suffer from not being able to use all of these scented things, this right here is going to have you feeling chef's kiss, okay? This is moisturizing, it feels good, it's a pump, and it's perfect for just a little extra moisturizing vibe value. I'm not gonna say you're gonna go from dry to like super creamy, so I'm gonna rate this like a seven or an eight out of 10 because it's it's not like super moisturizing, but it's just the perfect amount for all of my gals that just want like a little extra something because not everybody is dry and chapped like me. Okay, we have two more left and then we're done. I have the Kiehl's Soy Milk and Honey Whipped Body Butter. Okay, another one that's almost literally gone. I'm obsessed with this. This is honestly coming back around into my like everyday routine again. It's just that good. It's so fall and winter vibes. It's very creamy. It feels good. It makes you feel so soft. It gives a little sheen. I'm rating this an 8.5 out of 10. Honestly, the scent, if it lasted longer on the skin, I would probably rate it a 10 out of 10. The smell is amazing, but it just doesn't last like all day, like, like the Bomdia does and like the, um, creme brulee because these actually last like all day and then honestly the next thing which is the final thing for heels is the nourishing dry body oil this again is so crucial in my skincare i talked about this on my channel so many times this is a great body oil like i would say the difference between this and this one is this one is a dry oil so it's going to eventually like dry down and give a sheen where this one's more of a wet oil you're going to see that glisten and like that oil like texture on your skin a little bit more with this one so if you're more into like a dry oil and you don't want something that's going to be too like on the skin you want it to melt into the skin keels is your girl and it has a spray and it's easy to apply and it smells amazing, like you can't go wrong. I'm obsessed and literally like this is one of those oils that you know, you put on your body, you put it on, you put a robe on and it just melts into the skin and then when you go out, you're just shiny and gorgeous for no reason, duh. Okay, I hope that you guys enjoyed this very random impromptu lotion, body oil and body butter video. I really genuinely use all of these products. I have so many more in the vault that I didn't bring out today because I wanted to bring out the ones that I actually use religiously, and this does seem like a lot. It does, but I am a self-care queen, and I'm supposed to use a lot of these things, not only for you, because I'm crazy and I like to use them. Um, but yes, I use all of these religiously. You guys don't ever have to worry about me, you know, plug in something and me like leaving it in the cabinet for months at a time. No, this is actually in my weekly routine, so I love each one. They're really great, and um, if any of them kind of give you like a, oh, I kind of want that one, 
this is your time to pick it up because I really went into thorough detail about each product, why you should have it and why you need it and what's great about it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this random video. Like, comment, share, and subscribe if you haven't already. And let me know down in the comments other videos you guys want me to do in this style of video that you want me to do very soon that I can just do like in the evening when I'm just chilling by myself listening to um, meeting in my bedroom, the TikTok version. All right, guys. I love you guys so, so much. See y'all in my next video.